Hey Zips fans, Chad Welker here with a Zips Digital Network update from Skeels Field as the baseball team defeated Olivet College in two games to this afternoon. Game one, 13 to zero. Game two, nine to one in seven innings. Chris Sabo and Cameron Tilly had some comments on today's game. I mean, it's something we've been looking forward to and, and working for all year. It feels like it's been forever, honestly, um, especially after the season getting cut short and not having uh, much baseball. But we've been able to scrimmage a lot, and it was great to get back out here. Uh, just talk about your day as a whole. Uh, you had a big grand slam. You had multiple RBIs today. Just talk about what you were seeing uh, first time really facing live pitching in a while. Uh, honestly, I was just trying to trying to get a fastball and, and do some damage with it. Uh, luckily enough, I uh, I caught a fastball middle in and, and did what I was supposed to. Um, sort of uh, took my foot off the gas at the end there, but uh, definitely definitely will be back on track soon. And it was it was great seeing some live pitching. It's finally finally getting to play another team. That's uh, that's what we've been working for. It's going to be a pretty quick turnaround uh, going into a game on Tuesday, but uh, how nice is it to kind of get back into a flow of things? Uh, yeah, it, again, it's it's what we work for. I mean, we've been in and out of the field house all year because it's been because uh, it's been snowing. We uh, finally get out here, and um, yeah, as long as we get a play, we'll be happy, you know. So. Well, first of all, we're happy to play. It's been almost a year, almost a year to the day since we last played. Uh, it turned out to be nice. It was cold, but it was sunny. Now, it wasn't that unpleasant. Uh, I thought the first game, we swung the bats really well, and our pitchers pitched great. Uh, Steinbaugh and Hickert uh, threw a lot of strikes, and Meyer came in there and finished it. Uh, you throw strikes, you, you got a really good chance in this league. And the second game, uh, Creel started, uh, struggled a little bit, but figured it out, and uh, it was good to score uh, almost double digits again. So uh, that was good. That was a, a big emphasis this year, uh, starting last August was trying to be more offensive than we were last year. And uh, at least for the first two games of the year, we, we've done that. Uh, some key contributors today, Roy Thurman uh, led off the, uh, the, the day with the leadoff single. Um, and then uh, uh, Tilly was outstanding today. Can you just talk about their play a little bit? Yeah, Roy, Roy uh, brings a lot of energy. Uh, he, he can bunt, he can hit, uh, he, he runs the bases really well. Uh, so it's good to see him get off to a good start. Uh, unfortunately, last year he broke his thumb uh, a couple days before we started playing, so he really didn't get to play. So it's good to see him healthy and uh, out there doing well. And Tilly's a gamer. Uh, he's not he's not a great practice player, but once the game starts, he really does well. And uh, he had you know hit the ball very nicely today. And uh, like I said, it's, it's a good start. It's a good start, and uh, hopefully we can build on it next week and get ready for the following week and start our MAC uh, conference. Yeah, you have uh, a, a quick turnaround, and then you have uh, four games this upcoming week uh, starting on Wednesday. Just uh, maybe talk a little bit about what are some of the things you'll work on uh, leading into Wednesday. Well, same thing we always preach. You know, uh, battle hard for nine innings. Uh, don't give up uh, offensively. Uh, if you score five, you try to score six. If you score six, you try to score seven. Uh, and pitching is throwing strikes. Throw strikes. Uh, I think we have a good defense. If we throw strikes, we're dangerous. So uh, that's what we emphasize. Thanks, Coach. The baseball team will be back in action all week long. They will take on Wittenberg on Wednesday. Be sure to catch that on the Zips Digital Network. Have a great rest of your weekend, and as always, go Zips!